Hi kids. So today is Time Out Tuesday. It's March 24th and we're on day 1000 of quarantine. Just kidding. Um, but since today is Time Out Tuesday, the theme is to show healthy habits that we have and also wear some workout gear. So I've dressed up in my comfy workout gear even though I'm not gonna actually be working out. Let me see if I can set this down. I decided to wear my comfy yoga pants and my Arosi High School sweater. Um, and I decided to come outside into the backyard just because it's been too much being inside and every once in a while I like to get a little bit of fresh air. I may not be the most athletic person in the world but I do like to um, come outside and like I told you before I like to visit the cats and see what they're up to. Um, so today I'm going to be introducing you to my other little kitty that I have. His name's Boo Bear and when I first got Boo Bear I thought that I was lucky enough to have like kittens in my backyard. And I told my husband, I was like, oh my gosh, come here, I think we have kittens. There's kittens in the backyard, and right now he's running wild. Um, Bowie, come here. Come here, Boo. Um, I thought we had kittens, but actually it was Boo. And Boo is a really big, large cat. Um, he weighs about 13 pounds, but he has the highest pitch meow ever. Um, I don't know why his pitch of his meow is so high, but it is. Bowie, come here. He's in the middle of uh, digging in the dirt. So I'm gonna see if I can't get him to come over here so I can introduce you to him because he is so cute. And when you see him, you can't believe that his meow is as uh, high pitched as it is because he's so big and masculine, but he has the cutest kitty meow so, I've decided to come outside and kind of see what he's up to. Hey, Boo! Booey! Booey! Come here! I have something for you! Booey! But now he's not even listening to me. Damn him. Booey! Let me go get him. Okay. So. I tried to get him. He's being so mean to me. Look, there he is. Bowie, come here. So, let me talk to you about him a little bit. Sometimes he's super, super cuddly. Sometimes he's not. But do you hear that high-pitched meow? Listen to him. Come here, Boo. I want to introduce you to somebody. Bowie. Come here. Bear. Barry, what are you doing? So, like I said before, when I first got him, I thought he was gonna be like a group of kittens. But while I was in the backyard looking for the kittens, he came jumping over the boxwoods that we have here and I was very much shocked and surprised that that's where the noise was coming from because he is so big and he has such a high-pitched meow. And of course, I immediately wanted to keep him and my husband told me I was not allowed to keep him, but I broke the rules. And so what I did with him is I slowly started feeding him and he was much nicer than Coconut was. Coconut was not very nice. But they both kind of hang out around here. He tends to wander around a little bit more than she does and he gets a little bit rambunctious. So every once in a while, I'll see him kind of like running relays all around the backyard or like he was just doing right now. Sometimes he'll come to the front door and he's learned to knock on the front door to have us let him in. Um, he's gotten that spoiled. Uh, but most of the time he just kind of like runs around the yard and he wanders really far and then comes back he is known to hunt quite a bit. He actually is very good at catching things and bringing them back to us, which I don't want him to do because I appreciate the gesture, Boo, but no, no thank you. One time he decided to go after a squirrel and he caught it. 
and he had the squirrel in the backyard and he was flipping it all around, which was oh, so gross. So, so gross. But yeah, that's kind of his way of showing us how he loves us and appreciates us is by bringing us, look, there he goes. He's bringing us little treats. But yeah, he's sometimes really, really playful like this. What are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? Tiny bear. Berry boo. Yeah, he's looking for something to hunt. Look at him, on the prowl. Bear. What do you got? What'd you find? And there he goes. So he's in the mood right now to hunt and when he gets like that, it's, what the hell did he find? What is that? I don't like going around him when he's like this cause it's kind of like going around dogs when they have food. They might snap at you, but he definitely has something. I don't know what it is. Oh my God, if he caught a rodent, I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. What do you have? What's over there? Let's see what he's got. Cause this is kind of freaking me out. What do you have over there? Hey. I would probably drop dead right now if he had a rodent. Oh my gosh, I can't even tell you. I would probably lose my mind. What does he have? Bear, what's over there? Look at him, all wild, looking for something to hunt. Hey, what do you got? See, he's practicing his healthy habits and running around and exercising while I am not. I'm doing the exact opposite, just standing here watching him. Bear, where are you going? Hey, come back over here. Come here. Where are you going? Where are you going? Bear. What are you doing? Are you leaving me? You're saying goodbye? You're saying leave me alone, stop bothering me? Okay. I just wanna show everybody how cute you are. All right, boo. Well, I thought he'd be a little more entertaining for you guys because usually he's like super, super lovey. But today he's just in a mood. He's in the mood to hunt and be wild. Hey boo, say hi. What'd you catch for me? What'd you have for me? Are you gonna leave me? You're not gonna be here with me? Bowie, don't go. Don't go, tiny bear. Even though you're not so tiny. He's so cute. So yeah, this is who I like to hang out with, me and the boo bear. And he'll come to the door when he's not being so rowdy and rambunctious and out of control. Huh, bear? Yeah. Yeah, bear. Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? That you don't even want to hang out with me. Booey. He's like, leave me alone. So fine then, boo. So, there you have it, kids. That is my little tiny boo bear, who's not actually really little and tiny, but he is super cute and Coconut is always on the watch. She doesn't go that far, but Boo Bear does. He's off to go wander somewhere. But I just wanted to check in with you today and tell you that if you haven't gone outside today or even into your front yard, you don't have to go that far. But if you haven't gone outside today, today's a good day to do that because it is a good time to take a time out, take a break from your work, get some, well, there's no sunshine, but get some fresh air at least. Um, but yeah, take a small little break to get some air and I will be checking in with you tomorrow. I think tomorrow's theme is, I think it's the superhero theme tomorrow. I'm not really sure. I have to double check, but yeah, 
I hope you guys are all doing really well and I look forward to checking in with the blogs that you've created and seeing, you know, what you're coming up with. Remember when you create your blogs that it doesn't have to be the same thing. It could just be something that like maybe you've learned through your distance learning packets that you've been doing or maybe some like a funny joke that somebody's told you today that made you laugh or just something simple that you want to share with us because I know some of you are already telling me that, you know, not much has changed and that's okay. I get it but you'd still kind of want to branch out a little bit. I know if you're working on your uh, packets, there are some topics that you can look up for the electives portion of that packet that are just kind of fun topics to check into. I wanted to give you guys something a little fun to do. So if you're listening to a certain type of music right now to fit your mood, share that with me. I'm gonna be sharing some of my uh, favorite music tips and bands and all that kind of stuff with you coming up in our next future blogs. But yeah, I look forward to seeing what you guys are sharing with me. I love reading what you guys are doing and meeting relatives in your family with your pictures and your animals and your pets. So keep up the good work and I will check in with you tomorrow. Bye.